jump before it. They probably can't reach me here. It seems like I've underestimated my own creation. Ew, oh my god, this is disgusting. Why is it so sticky? It's no use trying to free yourself, Ban Ban. Kamataki has you cornered. Good luck running from us now! Kamataki's not messing around. Please, boys. You're overreacting. Think of what you were before. What we were before? I happen to like that version of us, Ban Ban. I used to be a normal turtle. I was born into captivity, and since I hatched, I was kept in the back room of a reptile collector. I spent my days isolated from the other animals in a plastic bin. I never even got to meet my brothers and sisters. I yearned for freedom, you see? For a turtle, I was exceptionally smart. My genius was far too vast to be contained in a plastic tub. And even if I couldn't have freedom, maybe at least some company? And his wish was granted in the form of me. Hi there. Oh my. It's been so long since I've seen anyone other than the hand that feeds me. Hey, look what I can do. Even though I was sad to see him trapped in the same fate as me, it was nice to have a friend. Also check this out, I can climb. So, how long have you been here? Since I was born. What? That's crazy. Were you not born here? Nope. I was just hanging out in a tree and then swoop. Now I'm here. Anyways, when do we get out of here? We don't. This is where you live now. Oh. You're just going to have to accept that this is your new home. Not if I can reach this latch. Wait, it's too far. Oof. Ugh. Well, at least we have each other. Right, friend? A friend? I never had one of those. Sure, he was boisterous and naive, but I did enjoy his presence. And I enjoyed Tamataki's. So I was determined to get us out of this glass prison together. But one night, I waited for him to fall asleep. You see, I'd been practicing something in secret. Yes! All I had to do was escape through the latch at the top. And try not to be seen. Psst! Tamataki! Oh, uh, sorry. It's me! How did you get in here? I'm breaking us out. Follow my lead. I admit, his plan involved more head trauma than I would have liked. Trust me. You... you did it! I can't believe you did it! Let's get out of here. I guess you could say my plan was pretty perfect. Perfect? Yeah, right. Remember the forest? Where are we? Okay. So I may or may not have thought much ahead of getting us out. I... I don't know. He didn't think of where we could go next, or how we would survive on our own. I vote we sneak up on it and... I thought we were going to share it. Sorry, I don't know turtles ate bugs. Maybe you can try these? <laughs> I think that was poison! My bad! I started getting annoyed with Kamataki. He had certain physical advantages I didn't. Well, so did you! Ah, we need to find shelter! No, uh, I'm good right here. Speaking of, remember the time with the hawk? Uh-oh! Run! I can't run! He left me for dead! No, no! I didn't! I knew you'd be okay! Oh my god, Tamataki! I had no idea you'd be okay! Uh-huh, sure. You know, maybe it would be better if we went our separate ways. What? Why? We're in this together. You got us into this mess! I saved us! You're the one who wanted to leave! How are we going to survive outside of captivity? Great. Probably another beast that's gonna try and swallow us whole. Maybe... We won't have to survive out of captivity! Hey! Hey, you! Stop that! It's not like they can understand you! Kamataki, wait! Take us with you! Take us! I'm sorry, Tamataki. You know what? It's fine. Because I am never speaking to you again. What? But we're best friends! Not anymore. 
Hello there, Mr. Chameleon. Are you ready to become extraordinary? Tomataki? Tomataki, help! Tomataki, I'm sorry! Maybe I deserved it. It was all my fault. Tomataki was the smart one, after all. I should have let him decide what to do, and I shouldn't have left him out to dry over and over. I just wish he'd forgive me. I wanted to, but I was stubborn, and was convinced I'd be better off without you. That is, of course, until I saw your plans, Panban. -Ban. You wanted to make Kamataki a monster, and I couldn't let that happen to my best friend. I had to save him, or at least try, so I followed his lead. All right, Tamataki, you can do this. Ah! Well, 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 aren't we bold? You know, since you two want to be together so badly, maybe I can figure it out so we're all happy, yes? You tried to save me? It was the least I could do, best friend. Change of plans, my scaly subjects. I've got an even better idea. Because the only thing better than a one-headed dragon, a two-headed dragon. Kamataki, we're all right. Kamataki, are you okay? What have you done? What are you doing? You'll pay for this, you monster thing! Uh-oh. Good luck catching me with those turtle legs. You better run! Oh, that was unexpected. I had no idea why Kamataki was freaking out. Sure, I wasn't happy either, but... But you're not getting away from me! You ruined my best friend's life. I have to make you pay! Is that why you're doing this? Of course! For me? Uh, I got us into this mess, Tamataki. I'll finally admit it. You wanted to be free, but now you're trapped here, stuck to me. Kamataki, if I have to be stuck to someone, I want it to be you. You're my best friend. And now, I guess we never have to be apart again. No more tanks? No more hawk attacks. I'd hug you, but we only have... Shared arms. See? You insolent little reptiles should be thanking me. Without my interference, you'd still be out in the wilderness, struggling to survive, eating bugs and poisonous fruit. I made you something bigger and better than you were before. The ultimate beast. The two-headed dragon. Well, I don't remember either of us asking for that, Ban-Ban. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and now you're going to pay. We'll see about that. Tamataki, you did it! We're finally free! No, Tamataki. We did it. <laughs>